Hello this is Rakesh Rao from Coordinate Systems and in this video I'm going to show you another workflow of the BOM BOQ tools in CAD Power. In this drawing you can see a layout of a departmental store with a block at the center which represents several properties of the store like area, shop number, floor, rental status and so on. So let us see how we can extract these to a table and to Excel as well. So I start the BOM command and in this example we are going to use attribute extract as a BOM type. So select a block that you want to extract so that is sweet info that is the name of the block. This block has got several attributes uh, which are going to be extracted now. The names of these attributes have already been entered in the INI file and you can see them here. For example, there's a attribute shop name, area, shop number, floor and rental status and following the equal to sign there is a description as well. So you can change any of these or you can make new entries for attributes, update existing ones and so on. So this step is similar to what you have seen in the previous video where we counted the block name. So when you start this for the first time, you will not have an INI file with the attributes. So you can use this option here called add all attributes to INI and quickly create an INI file containing all the attributes. So in this case, I have the attribute. So I'm just going to run the command now. Just say OK. So select entities. Let me say all, pick insertion point of table, that's over here. So it has already created the table and it asks me if I want to scale it. It looks fine, so I say no. And it's exported this to a CSV file as well. Now if you zoom in and see, you can see that the attributes and their descriptions are neatly tabulated in this table here. So there is a description, area, address, floor number and lease status. So at the moment you can see that it is sorted by the first attribute. So you can see it's already sorted by the name. But let us say you want to sort by a particular column, like you want to sort by lease status or by the address, then that's possible as well. So we just start the command once again. And there's an option here called sort attribute one. So I'm going to sort by rental status. Let's say OK. Each time I run the BOM command, it asks me whether you want to delete or keep the previous table. So in this case, I'm just going to delete it and create a new one. So you can see that now the same table has been created, but it's sorted as per the lease status, as per the rental status. So you can see that all the status E are together and so on. You can see that the output has been created in a file which can directly be opened in Excel and like in the previous case you can add any new information you want here or change anything you want and you can import it back into CAD as well. So this is the second workflow that I've shown you in the BOM BOQ command. So attribute extract, that is what we have seen now. In the next videos, you will see the other workflows as well. Thank you.